some? No. Where are you going to put it? You give me a, anything dirty. Anything care. dirty. Something that's not nice. Of course. <laughs> Here, grab my shirt. Oh, oh. That it, it has like stains Whoa. on it. Oh my gosh, you can actually see in there. Well, I don't want to scrape the magnetic strip. Change the angle the water is pointing. Just for fun, just to change it up a bit. Okay, no, it's the other side. Okay. Look how pretty it is. I know. Can I have some? Can you have what? Can I have some of the plants? Yeah, yes, you do. Yes! All yours. Yeah. I'll take your squanch. Squanch. Squanchy squanch. Yeah, I have black shrooms. How many? Uh, a couple. I don't remember how many. I see two right now. They were literally darker than the, um, than the gravel. Oh, hon, look, look, look. Stop real quick. You're, you, he was stuck. Also, look. Do you see that shrimp down in there? Yeah, he a big chunky boy. Hello, Poor man. baby fish. I know. He's like, oh, I can see outside now. <laughs> Hi, baby. What you doing? You're splashing me with water. No, I mean to. I'm just trying to get some of it off the back. I know I won't be able to get much off the back. Since there's so much plant. Yeah, there's like literally no water in the tank. <laughs> it's just plant. Only two months? Yeah. God dang. Look at her. Look She's just... Existing. Yeah, no, look how oh, hon, she's really stressed out. Hold on a second. Okay, hold on, I have one. She's breathing really <laughs> hard. Okay. I'm so we babe. <laughs> I'm so she's probably breathing in algae. Yeah. Come up, get Ella. <laughs> Put the top back on. Ah, water on my foot. Sorry. Oh, okay. It's okay. It's okay, baby. It's okay. Oh, it's because you changed the direction of the water flow. Yeah. She's like, ah, there's a new current right here where she's just existing. Adding water in the back. Hey, you see the water over here filling up? It's really cool. Yeah, it's really thick. You wanna, you wanna scoop some up? Yeah. That's how much we have out so far. It's a crap ton, isn't it? Yep, good lordy. She just ate her own poop. Good times. That's fine. It'll look better over time. Yeah. Look at it. There's still some taller plants in the back. Yeah. Well, your taller plants were kind of swallowed out by all that moss. Yeah. I mean, look. There was a piece of wood in there. Yeah. All that hair grass back there in the back. <laughs> it's a nice tink. But we made a mess. Yeah. We made a mess. <laughs> Fun times. Ah! Okay, so this is after me and Tyler had finished up his tank. I brought it all back to my dorm, and you can see I'm drying off this piece of wood that I got out of my tank. Gotta make sure that's all dry, so whenever I pull out the moss and I wring some of the water out of it. I can actually attach it to the wood using super glue. Now I don't use plant glue, I use normal super glue. It's what Tyler used to attach to his wood and rocks. As you can see I'm having a little bit of trouble right there. <laughs> Oh, 
and I'm just applying a lot to it. You have to make sure both surfaces are like dry and as you can see I am pushing it down with the back of the glue because last time I super glued my fingers whenever I was trying to do the rock in the back of my tank. Now I know that whenever I do put this in there, oh, already got some on my fingers. <laughs> we all knew this was going to happen. There I am messing with it. I'm not a big fan of super glue on my fingers. Now I know I'm not going to be able to put everything onto this piece of wood, and I also know that all of the moss that I'm sticking down right now will not all stick onto the wood. I'm going to leave the bottom part of the wood exposed because I am sticking this into the substrate of my tank and I will be adding a beta, the beta fish that you saw in Tyler's tank back into my tank. That's originally my beta fish, but I took her out because she was eating all of my tiny little new hatched baby shrimp. So. He held on to her for right now while they grew up, and I could get some good plants going so that they could all hide. You know, hide from her eating. <laughs> There's just so much water in this. There's so much moss from this, like, goodness gracious. Drying it off, drying it off. Me and Tyler had to record the first and last half of us cleaning out his tank uh, on two separate days because uh, Glow, that's the beta fish name, her, she got really stressed out and we wanted to make sure that uh, we didn't stress her out too much. So we did, um, we recorded the first part of that video uh, one night and then we waited a couple of days and a couple of days and then we trimmed up the tank. I'm telling you guys, there's a lot of moss here. I'm trying to like fluff the moss out, kind of. Find out what pieces are still not attached. Looks like that came unglued. And I do let this piece of wood sit out for 10 minutes before I put it back in my tank just to make sure everything sticks all nice and neatly. And it doesn't immediately come off as soon as I put it back in the tank because that has happened before as well. I think I ended up using all of my the rest of my super glue in this so I'm gonna have to go get some more super glue. <laughs> I think this is where I found a dead shrimp. Yep I found uh, a dead shrimp in the moss. It was one of Tyler's cherry shrimps that he got from Petco and they had gone missing. And so, we assumed the worst, we assumed that the beta ate them, but apparently, one of them just died in the moss. <laughs> so, this is what it looks like afterward. I did have some, it was called like fry hide or something like that excuse the penny um as you can see they're right down there there were little plastic uh fern looking things that were supposed to hide baby fry oh if you can see the shrimp it's having a blast Look at them, they're just enjoying life over here. My camera is not wanting to focus, sorry guys. They're right there, right in front of you. Why can you not focus? But these guys over here are having a blast.
it's apparently not gonna let me zoom in so or focus so I will definitely figure out if you guys know what the names of some of these plants are please do let me know I bought these red ones in the back this green one right here has sprouted too they came from my moss not the one that I got from Tyler my boyfriend but um ones that I bought myself um that blue plant back there in the back is fake that top plant back there if you guys can see her is another one that needs to be named um there was a tall there were some tall background plants um that tyler put up in the front of his tank that need to be identified of course we have moss balls if you guys can tell me what moss this is me and tyler are kind of stuck in between christmas moss java moss look at him my phone just focus on these guys hmm it's weird but um I think that 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 I know I have a java fern back in here here is a better view of those red plants as you can see my shrimp are taking a liking to them camera doesn't even want to focus on this see there's my java fern here is a better kind of view of those plants that are in the back there's my little setup back there but it's really nice view from the top but yeah thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos and to hit the bell icon so you don't miss any new uploads. I'm going to ask you guys a question. What do you guys do to stop your moss balls from turning brown? Um, I've been rotating them. I've been kind of rinsing them out uh, every water change that I do, but I can't seem to get them to stay green. Now, Tyler's moss ball, wherever it has hidden in this tank, uh, has turned green is is still green so I don't know if I'm doing something wrong am I not putting enough uh, excel in the water I honestly have no clue look at all of my shrimp guys shrimp utopia in here look at all of them they're having so much fun Man, I could just sit here and record these guys all day because they're having so much fun in here. Look at this little guy. Well, if my phone would let me focus on him. It's trying to focus on the moss balls that are in the background. I want you guys to see this cute, oh my gosh. Just out of focus. Okay, well, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.